If you're doing a cruise in the South Pacific, one of the port stops is Noumea. But what is there to do there? Coming up, a few facts about Noumea that you need to know as a cruiser, and my suggestions on what shore tours to do there. If you've been here before or just want to have a look at my suggestions for shore tours, simply fast forward to the part about what to do there. Let's start off with a few facts that you might need to know if you're a first time cruiser. Located approximately 1,470 kilometers from Brisbane, Australia is Noumea, the capital city of New Caledonia in the South Pacific. The locals first language is French, but for most cruise ship passengers they will also be able to speak English. If you're wanting to purchase something, Noumea's local currency is Pacific franc, but some places will accept currencies such as the Australian and American dollars, but try only to give small donations as you might not get any change. Noumea is the major port that cruise ships go to in New Caledonia and as such all cruise ships will usually go there if they're in the area. Larger ships will dock at the country's working port. This gives an unfortunate first viewable impression. It's unfortunate because as soon as you leave and explore, you'll notice that the city is quite beautiful looking and not the complete industrial area that greets you. Smaller ships have the option of docking at the Numea Cruise Terminal. Either way, you'll arrive at the terminal as larger ships bus their passengers to the cruise terminal. If you're wondering what to do there when you arrive, these are my best recommendations that I've personally done so far in Numea. If traveling on a budget and not wanting to go far from the cruise terminal, have a walk around. There are parks and shops close by. If you're after some locally made food, a personal favorite is to try the patisserie that is located a couple of streets from the cruise terminal. Hop on hop off bus. An alternative to walking around is the hop on hop off bus or ho ho bus. This gets you a little further around the city and shows you more of what Numea has to offer. The Hoho -Ho bus operates all day and takes you to locations further than just walking around. Stops include the Market City, the New Caledonia Museum, the Aquarium and others. And don't worry, it returns to the cruise terminal with buses going every half hour. There are a couple of different operators, just make sure you get on the right bus. If you're taking the Hoho -Ho bus, my favourite stop is Lemon Bay. Lemon Bay is a beach surrounded by trees that give off plenty of shade. There are restaurants close by if you're wanting something to eat. The last time I was here the water was like a bath and jumping off the pontoon was incredibly fun. The Choo Choo Train The Choo Choo Train that takes you around Noumea if you're wanting to see most of the highlights and viewpoints that Noumea has to offer is your best option. This is my biggest recommendation if it's your first time in Noumea. Duck Island If you're wanting to do some snorkeling, Duck Island is one of the ways of doing it. Offering a variety of coral and fish, it's a great way to enjoy the day. Depending on who you book through, you can get a lounge chair with umbrellas. If not, just make sure to bring some sunscreen as it gets hot and shade isn't always available. Before my last suggestion, if you've been to New Me before, what's the best excursion you've done? Also, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and if you have, thanks! Lastly, look no further than Signal Island. Located 30 minutes from Noumea, it is a beautiful marine reserve with fish, coral and the ability to swim with turtles. If you want to see a full video of Signal Island, check out this video here. And thanks for watching.